we're going to be using this typography box frame from the ReStore for this project. This one's great because for a buck, we're going to double our money and do a two-sided sign. I've already gone ahead and painted this a beautiful dark gray chalk paint all the way around, leaving the center in white paint, creating like a beautiful box frame. I've got a couple of things I can finish this out with, this scrapbook paper or some leftover wrapping paper. I just love these birds and I thought they were perfect for what we were doing here. I'm going to be using some Mod Podge to put them down after I trim them just about as close as I could with a nice sharp pair of scissors. You want to put a fine but even layer of Mod Podge down, put your bird down and put another light layer over top. Now to make sure this has a great finish on it, we're actually going to put that Mod Podge all over the white paint and the interior part of the gray frame so it all has the same matte finish. With one side finished, we can turn our attention to the other side and I have a leftover metal flower from an old project that we're going to use on the outside of the box frame. To attach the flower, I'm going to use this small wooden block and some hot glue, first attaching it to the back of the flower and then we're going to do the same thing and attach it to the box frame. Make sure you get whatever you're putting here right in the center so it doesn't drive you crazy down the road. I had already gone ahead and painted this Restore candlestick in the same dark gray chalk paint and I'm going to be using E6000 as well as some hot glue to attach this to the bottom of the box frame. And just like that, from a $1 Restore find, we have created two beautiful pieces of home decor. This one on the candlestick with that beautiful metal flower left over from an old project. And not gonna lie, you guys, I am loving these birds from some leftover old wrapping paper. Can you even imagine the possibilities that you could do to make this suit your home decor?